Greetings, my friends. Happy Saturday. Thanks for stopping by. Let's check out the new addition to the cargo. Got a swing away hitch and a new cargo platform. The swing away is from Kuat. It's a really good quality. I like the design. Swings out. It doesn't bow down at all. And I've got all my stuff in this box. So I've got about probably 100 pounds on this rack and it's rated up to uh, 250 all right so uh, let's see let's give you the walk around I can get to the doors easy swings out to the driver side which is important to me The, the ratchet strap is really doing nothing because the box is bolted to the platform. Got a lot of room on each side. Alright, let me show you, uh, let's see, uh, let's try some things here. Be right back. Alright, let's see if we can walk and chew gum at the same time. So I'm going to swing this in. Wow, that is smooth. The pin catches, and then for extra security, you lift this handle here up. Nice, nice and secure. Uh, let's see what else I need to tell you about this. Oh, okay, so uh, this uh, is two separate items. I got this platform off of Amazon. Well, I got, and I bought the swing away straight from the manufacturer. And when I put it on, it stuck out so far. I think it was sticking out off the back of the van another foot in length, and it just looked weird. So since I'm down here at my dad's, he's got a lot of tools and stuff. I was able to cut the the shank that comes off of this off about 10 inches to where it's just as long as the receiver is now and of course I got my locking hitch pin through there and I've got another locking hitch pin under there where it goes into the receiver so now um, it's a nice reasonable distance off the back bumper I think I've added, what, about three feet off the back of the van. And that's reasonable for a swing away hitch. But before it was sticking off so far, it just looked ridiculous. So uh, I was able to cut about 10 inches of length off of this shaft here, redrill the pilot hole. He has a drill press I was able to do that with. Without these tools, I could have never done that. But keep in mind, this platform has a long shank on it because it's not designed to be going into a short shank swing away. It's designed to go straight into the receiver. So, if you're getting a swing away, make sure you're getting a short shank uh, category three receiver insert. All right, what else is there to tell you? I put some reflector tape around it because people love to run into the back of you when you got these things on the back of your van. And uh, I've got, it's highly visible. So yeah, I'll just give you a good shot of things here. So I'm so glad I didn't get an extended length van now because what am I running on about 20, four feet of vehicle here now I think these vans are 20 feet long from bumper to bumper and I've added another three and a half back here maybe <laughs> but uh, I'll still be able to fit into parking spaces and uh, having this swing away is gonna be great here let's show you again you take this and push it down and you squeeze this 
look how strong that bearing is and then it locks right there so I've got all this room to get into the back that's not gonna be an issue anymore this is great and when you start to close it back in you do have to squeeze the handle again let me show you you got to squeeze that and then pull it in and then reach here push that underneath that receiver and pull up hard man that is secure all right that's sweet and inside the box is all my goodies my Jenny um, all my different items I keep around with it I just dewinterized the generator uh, you know clean the spark plug uh, change the oil all that good stuff air filter all that good stuff and uh, generator's been running for about half hour and uh, it's ready for it's ready for use now all right guys I'll give you a shot of this massive package we got going on here now wow that's a nice scene right there all right guys take care be well smash the bell